Greetings, entities and guardians. My name is Hyper Himes, and welcome back to Kick Run Oven Break, where again we're going to be dwelling ourselves back into the Sun Tournament because we're going to be doing stages two and three today. Where somehow, which I actually don't understand how this works, apparently they're like, if you're wondering how the last episode went, we had a cutscene where uh, apparently there was like a match between like the last four chosen cookies, which was a uh, what was it? Well. First, let me just say, if you haven't seen the last video, I recommend that you do so, so you can see the cutscenes. But it was like, I think it was a match between Dark Chocolate Cookie, uh, General Jujube Cookie, uh, Cream Soda Cookie, and Cherry Cola Cookie. But, or Soda Cream, either or. But the thing is, for some reason, when they all fought, apparently Cream, so or Soda Cream, whatever, it doesn't matter. But, it might be Soda Cream, or Cream Soda. Can I check? I'm gonna check just in case, because I don't want to be wrong on this. I'm not even joking. I legit want to be like cream soda. So it's cream soda, cherry cola. Okay, that's fine. Uh, so anyway, uh, they were having all that, and for some reason, cream soda and cherry cola teamed up on Dark Shaco and General Jubi, and somehow they both lost, and that's how uh, the two ended up winning, which it kind of seemed obvious, but now they have to fight against each other now, so that's gonna be great considering this place is called the Hall of Desolate Red. So it's probably gonna have to do with uh, it being covered in uh, cherry cola's. Soda juice? That makes no sense when I say it like that, and even if it does, I'm afraid. But anyway, now we have a pepperoncino cookie unlocked, which... Okay, it's not, not, they're not unlocked, you have to literally meet all the cookies, which I'm pretty sure it's Dark Choco and, uh... Is it Dark Choco? It's Dark Choco and Leek, right? Which I'm pretty sure, those are just the next cookies I've Yeah, Leek and Dark Choco. Sounds about right. If you can play as them, there's a high likelihood that you have to meet them. So, we have to go through stages 2 and 3 this time, because uh, the only reason why we didn't in the first part of chapter 2 is because... Well, uh, oh yeah, I forgot I gotta do this. Shoosh. Uh, just to absorb all these. And... Oh, that's a good amount of obstacles destroyed. Nice, nice. Uh, but the reason why is because, like, in the video prior... Prior. Uh, can I just... You... Note to self! You can't break those! I just assumed you could because I'm pretty sure Cher uh, Cherry Cola Cookie could. But uh, no, that's definitely wrong on my behalf. Okay, note to self, don't just do that willy-nilly. Uh, bam. And I just do that, there we go. Maybe it wasn't the most optimal jump, but who cares? Okay, anyway, don't destroy those unless if you can actually have something to destroy them with. I know that make didn't make any sense, but uh, I know what I mean. But maybe it's best to like use them... Uh, Appropriately, like for example, right there, where like you could actually destroy things. Probably when there's a lot of things to destroy. Like, oh, I want to use it right here, but I just don't know. Like, because the third jump is gonna be the most confusing, because it's like, okay, first one just straight down. Second one a little bit forward, but nothing too far. And then the third one, it's just big leap. Just good luck where you, where you find out where you land. Uh, so, or, yep, just get those. But then after this one, I don't know where I'm gonna land, so we'll just see. Okay, that was actually pretty good. And the thing is, you kind of do have to give a good pop towards those uh, cherry things, like the cherry obstacles, because they give you pink bear jellies, which is very helpful. Like, all oh, these things I can destroy, and they give a good amount of uh, flipping points, too. Like, hundreds of thousands. Uh, just wait for it. Wait for it. Might be something I can destroy. Uh, there's nothing. Uh, maybe one thing, but uh, it wasn't really a good destruction obstacle placement. I don't even know what I just said right there, but I, I think I knew what I was trying to say, so that's all that matters. Uh... There, okay, break those. Nice, nice. I missed some of those. Uh, okay, you know what? That wasn't too bad. Got a couple pink bird jellies right there, which that's all I'm asking for. Uh, destroy those. That was perfect. Literally used the giant's potion just to bash down all these. Why didn't they make a Grand Champions League level based off this? Just, like, get the giant potion and, like, break as many of these as possible. I understand, like, they had a, like, thing going on where it was like, hey, you have to, uh... Which, by the way, I should probably start spamming this because I need to get this skill out the way just so I can get an extra amount of points. And I instantly landed and smashed and just died. How many mission points was that? Because I hope it wasn't enough, but most likely was not enough. 18 missions. Uh, I think I need, like, a super high score. At least, I think I need... Don't I need to get to, like, 400 million? Just so I can, like, get the gold coin? Oh, no, wait. I just destroyed 100 obstacles. Well, that was more than enough for me, I'm pretty sure. So if I claim it all, I should be able to get the next one. Yes, I did! And Cherry Killer Kiki seems proud, and I get the background of, uh, just the normal place. Pretty good. I'm sorry I couldn't keep my promise. I feel so ashamed. What promise did you break? I wanted to hand you the Sunblade, but I couldn't even get close. You know I'm not interested in power or fame. Watching all your matches, I could see your sincerity thinking about me. That's enough for me. You're already a winner in my eyes. Congratulations, and if my bouquet isn't enough, think of this entire garden as a bouquet. Rose Cookie. And congratulations to the finalists too. I mean, you Cherry Color Cookie. 
Oh, how did you know I was hiding? I could see you fidgeting among the rose petals. Oh my, got so focused I lost sight of my surroundings for a moment. Since our last meeting here, I've always seen you with cream soda cookie, but you're alone today. Preparing for the finals in Paris separately? I just got a lot on my mind. If you need to, you can practice here. The garden belongs to no one. Right, Raspberry Moose Cookie? Uh, yes, of course. It's, it's fine. I I need to practice. I, I have to win. You don't seem to be enjoying your victory. Is something wrong? You look uneasy. I'm happy to be in the finals, but also not happy. You know, that's disrespectful to those who fought in their best against you, right? Sorry, I I did try my best, but... Terracolor Cookie probably didn't mean it in that way. Why do you feel like this? I don't want to fight Cream Soda Cookie. I, I'm afraid she'll hate me. Have you ever felt like you've lost yourself during our fights? Is it because of that? You've noticed? Then, then Cream Soda Cookie will probably notice when I fight her too. What, what, what do I do? If you don't want to talk about it, you don't have to, but if you do, feel free to share. Like rose petals fluttering in a gentle breeze. Well, actually... Oh, hello. <sighs> Still not enough. I'll start over from the beginning. It's a swordsmanship school student cookie. Chill, cool cookie. Practicing all alone here? You're always the last one to leave, aren't you? Aren't you tired? <sighs> no, it's it's fine. Just thanks for asking. No, no need to be so cautious. I I picked up your mail while I was getting my package. I'll, I'll just leave it right here. Uh, letter from Cream Soda Cookie. Cream Soda Cookie is amazing as always. She was re-elected as the student council president. Compared to that, I struggle just to fit in. Cream Soda Cookie be disappointed when she sees me like this. I thought I could make friends with other Soda Cookies. This isn't the time for this. Even if I can't make friends, I can still practice alone. I have to train hard so I can stand proud when we meet once again. <sighs> again. Again. I have to get stronger than anyone. My arms are shaking, but it's still not enough. If I don't, I might lose Cream Soda Cookie, too. Then I'd be completely alone. Uh, I'm gonna explode! When I came to my senses, part of the school was gone. Luckily, no one was hurt, but I told the school I'd train alone from now on to avoid any accidents like that. I'm afraid Cream Soda Cookie will get hurt, too, and that we won't be friends anymore. As a graduate of a strict swordsmanship school, I understand the pressure that you are under. As a fellow Swords Cookie, I may I give you some advice. A desperate sword is strong, but can be dangerous. When wielding a weapon, you must keep your wits and look at the bigger picture. I've learned that in school too, but I can't seem to do it. I'm so tense in matches, afraid something might happen, and when I'm tense, I lose control. Then let me teach you how to control your emotions. I've wielded my sword in many battles. I can help. Really? <sighs> Thank you. Since your sword is for someone precious, I understand your concern. Let's start right away. Hmm. I'll play some elegant tango music to cover up your secret lesson. Wouldn't that just track others? <laughs> I need to calm myself for the finals. It's finally time to face Cherry Cola Cookie. I didn't expect you to notice it too. Dark powers eat away at you. Sometimes it even over, over sometimes it even overcomes you. Even if the cookie isn't evil, you must be careful. Huh? Dark chocolate cookie and general jujube cookie. What are they talking about? Cream soda cookie. Good at timing. Before the finals, can we also for some advice as fellow swords cookies? Uh, of course, I'm I'm grateful. It's an honor to get advice from the best sword cookies. There's as much history behind every cookie as there are mountain ranges and oceans. When you point your sword at an opponent, I recommend seeing the background behind them too. Don't let your guard down. Darkness can overcome you in an instant. What did Dark Chaco and General Jujube Cookie mean? They said it was advice for the finals, so they must be talking about Cherry Color Cookie. What happened when they fought Cherry Color Cookie? I have to ask after the finals. Now we have Golem Plain Stadium. Interesting. I'm surprised how in this portion, like, we didn't get, like, the background of where Shella, uh, Cherry Color Cookie was training as, like, a thing. Well, what's important is that we need to meet Leak Cookie now. And most likely in the next video, we have to play as Leak Cookie. So, before I continue, I need to take a sip of the drink, because this... Doing the impression of cookies have been killing my voice. Mm. Especially when I'm doing back-to-back-to-back -back -to -back recordings. Oh! All right. Stage number three. And it's a golem thing. What does this mean? Okay, so it seems like a normal stage. Uh, pool. Lanes. Okay. Oh, that. Oh, that's the emerald golem. Oh, yeah. I forget. Yeah, that's represent. Okay, that's cool. I like that. All right, go. Well, it destroyed some obstacles right there. Hopefully, that could be another mission. Even though it most likely isn't. I mean, 
Maybe in regards to getting silver coins, yeah, but like not getting the gold because if that was the case, then uh, I wouldn't have to meet Leak Cookie because Leak Cookie gives us the guaranteed gold. Uh, let's just do this. Uh, do this first. Uh, we're just gonna attract all those just to slurp all these up because uh, it'd be easier. I feel like it'd be better to use those against obstacles, but hey, I'll take to collecting all the jellies regardless con uh, considering that it gives us magnetization anyway. Pop that just in case because I don't want to get hit. Uh, but yeah, make sure you use all these skills just to make sure you break everything in your path and get a lot of points While also make sure not to waste them because if you waste them uh, Good luck because if you waste them well Then that means they just reset like, like for example if I had one right there I think if it reset the uh, little timer thing it would just go back up to three it wouldn't go to four No, it would just get rid of your one so you need to crank out as many of those as you can because uh, you gotta get the points uh, Just do this break all those I did miss some rainbow bird jellies. I probably could have used the skill here, but we're still fine for the most part. So I think considering the life potion was there, uh, we're at like the second phase of the level, considering now we're seeing arrows go around us. So that's probably not good. Get rid of these. Uh, sure. Uh, jump up and then do that. Cheeky. Nice. And one more, which we're going to do right about here. Bam. All right. Didn't get all the rainbow bird jellies, but it's still fine. I like how I kind of when I say things fast, it's like you can understand what I'm saying, but also not because I'm saying like rainbow bear jellies, but at the same note, I'm basically saying rain bear jellies. Let's just rain, rain bear jellies, rain bear jellies, ring the bear jellies. Anyway, let's do this because I think my skill can activate like one more time. Man, I just blew up that whole stadium part portion right there. Like, sheesh, it was a boom. There it all goes. Oops, crumbles down. Now I know how Cherry Cookie must feel. Anyway, let me just spam this. But oh yeah, me Cookie, you're right here. I was about to say, why is my skill not activating? And turns out Leak Cookie was just sitting right there. Ha! I'm waiting for the chance to face you once for all. Take my Leak Blade. Ha! Leak Cookie, wh where did you come from? It it's break time now. Ha! Quick reflexes. Anywhere can become a sparring arena as long as both Sword Cookie throw their blades. Will you share the honor of a spar with me, much like old friends sharing a cup of tea? I, I don't want to. Just leave me alone, please. You did not wield your sword during individual matches as you did in the team matches. It's about time you revealed your true strength. I'm sure it will come in light in the earnest fight. <laughs> That's... Cherry Color Cookie, I suggest you take this seriously. Unless you're so confident in your own strength that you're looking down on me. I'm not looking down at you. I just... I just wanted to win. It's... Don't... Don't shake me up. I won't be able to hold back. That's exactly what I want. Don't hold back. Now take the link slash. They can't be helped. I'll give it my all. Okay, well, okay, apparently she's just like, Oh, okay, you want, the, you want to run hands? I was trying to put pacifism on your side, which I, I also realized the moment that you meet the cookie, that's where like the level ends. So you have to make it through the entire level first, which she's just like, oh, you want to run hands? Even though I tried to do this innocently and like, like a pacifist. You can't hear this, but like my bones cracking. Oh. Ring finger, please, please. Can you pop? Well, I know my thumb can just crack your fingers. If only I could. There we go. Finally, ring finger. Maybe this is right. Wait, is this in the correct? Yeah, this is the wrong. Maybe that's why. I'm... Anyway, I'm sorry. That's just off topic talk. Uh, anyway, now we have Lee Cookie and also Lee Cookie's pet, which we have access to now, which we we always have access to it. I'm just saying, for sake of playability, I think it's necessary just to play as the cookie, which makes sense here. By the way, surprise bear jelly. Just go ahead and include that real quick. Thank you. Pop. Bam. And now we can collect all this. And now we should have access to uh, the rest of the stage. And by the rest of the stage, I mean... Uh, Stage four, but also another cutscene time. Ooh, I can't believe we made it to the finals. We're so close to our promise, and I'm so happy. Me too. I'll give it my all. Cream soda cookie. You should check the main gate. You got some letters too. You're getting as many fan letters as I do. Wow, letters from friends. Looks like the whole school wrote. You look so happy. I, I didn't know you liked getting letters this much. Of course, they're always heartwarming. C can I read them now? Uh, of course. Go, uh, go ahead. Cream Soda Cookie, we may not be there to watch, but we're always cheering for you. You're always our number one. You know you're the pride of our school, right? We're planning a surprise party for your return. Oops, I, I guess it's not a surprise now, but we want to make sure to, that you know how much we support you. I'm so touched. I, I need to write back soon. Your new friends are so different from me, but it makes sense. If if I were my friend, I'd get tired of me too. Cherry Color Cookie, are you okay? You don't look so good. I'm sure your school friends are cheering for you too. Cheering? They're probably avoiding me because they're scared. I don't want to tell Cream Soda Cookie about my school life. Winning is all I have left, and it's the only way I can prove myself. Is everyone here? It's time for the finals. 
The contestants are Cream Soda Cookie and Cherry Cola Cookie. Cherry Cola Cookie, it's been a long time since we faced each other head on. Let's do our best. No matter the outcome, I'll just give it your all. I want to win. I want to stay Cream Soda Cookie's best friend. But I don't want Cream Soda Cookie to lose. What am, what am I feeling? Raspberry Moose Cookie said to focus only on the sword during the fight, but if it goes on like this... Let the finals begin. Yeah! <sighs> Your soda bubbles are popping more than ever. Don't hesitate. Clash sword with me. This is a real fight, not practice. I know, but... But... Sherikola Kiki is getting pushed back so easily. He wasn't this week before. So something's off. What's the point of dual wielding if you barely use one sword? I can tell that she's holding back. I truly saw her improvement during practice. What happened since then? The conclusion is near. If I lose like this, I'll be nothing. I'll be nothing! T Cherry Cola Cookie, you're finally fighting for real? I can't lose. I can't lose like this. If I lose, I'll... Oh, my, my soda bubbles are weakening. Oh, no, I, I, I can't just give up. Let's promise to congratulate you. Just, we need to congratulate each other no matter who wins. Even during the final match, you're so kind. And that's why everyone supports you. I want to cheer for you too, and I hate that I have these dark thoughts, but if I lose now... Oh, oh. Uh, I'm gonna explode! How, how are you this fast? What? Your power's too, too strong? Wait, what do I do? What do I do? If this keeps up, she's gonna find out. Uh, cream soda cookie. No. Go, get, go, go, get, just get away. What if... Cream Soda Cookie gets hurt too. My swords, I, I can't, I can't stop them. Ah! Cream Soda Cookie's down. The winner is Cherry Cola Cookie. Could you imagine just like next part? Well, that's where the part end, obviously. But like stage four is probably gonna be like, if I could predict. Uh, which, by the way, now we can. Well, I guess we're running with the uh, Cherry Cola again for some reason. I would like to run with Leak, but maybe I'll just do it once. Just uh, for form factor, just, you know, tradition. But, in any case, I think stage four is going to have, uh, you know, cream soda coming back up. Just going like, oh, that was cool. Good job on you. But cherry cola is just like, what? But I thought I, like, killed you. And and then, like, stuff like that happens. But then stage five, it's kind of like cherry cola actually pulling up the sword and realizing why they truly need it. But, uh, yeah, either or. Either, either way could go uh, hand in hand. But, uh, kind of expected all this to happen. I know what to use for the plumbing thumbnail because, uh, well, didn't you see just Cherry Cola just, like, blow up? Heck, I'm pretty sure, wasn't that part of the scene? Was that, is that the one? I don't know, Dark Chocolate kind of is uh, blocking some of it up. I'm pretty sure that's the scene back there. But uh, whatever, whatever the case is, uh, if you enjoyed the video, then please be sure to leave a like on it. And also share the video with your friends if you enjoy my Kicker Run content. And if you enjoy my content in general, then why not subscribe? And also hit the bell icon to be notified of whatever I do in the future. And also down below in the description, you will see links to all of my social media, including a Twitter post where if it gets 10,000 likes, I can, I can get the Kicker Run YouTube staff for absolutely free. There's also a link to my Discord server called the Hype Needs Hub. A link to my merchandise where you can buy stuff to represent the channel. And lastly, a link to my Kofi where for just $1 a month, you can see exclusive content that you wouldn't normally see in this normal YouTube channel. But above all else, I will see you entities and guardians in the next video. Hail the hype, please.